Hi, thanks for watching my YouTube channel. Today we are talk about it's not the camera related. I'm showing the this one, Ugreen SATA hard drive docking station. And the reason I want to share this toy, this gadgets with everyone, because I know the English is not my first language. But after I purchased it, I read the menu and I feel kind of confusing. It's how I going to do the offline, this copy. After I study a little bit, I think the instruction doing okay. It can be more detailed, explained to people. That's why I take the video to show the people how to doing the offline hard drive copy. Okay, the offline hard drive copy, you can duplicate the hard drive without the computer. So you can plug in two hard drives into the big one and the big two. When you press the button, they will duplicate the hard drive automatically from the bay one to bay two. Remember, there's one to two. You cannot go on another way from two to one. You have to do it from the bay one to bay two. When we're using this docking, we need to be careful. Don't put the reverse way. That's it. Let's go watch a video, see how everything operated. Bye. Of course, we have to turn on the power. Okay, so first power on and hold and the press the copy button three to five seconds. And we can see the indicate light from one, two, three, four, back and forth. And then repress again and the hard drive will start to duplicate it. Remember, it's from bay one to bay two. And the entire copy process, you see the video, and copy from 250 gig to 4 TB drive and take around like uh, one hour 45 minutes. The video is doing the fast forward because I don't want people to feel bored for watch entire an hour 45 minutes. Okay, so when the finish copy. They will have a B. So that means the copy is ready. Remember for the safety purpose, don't do the hot swap. Plug in the power, plug in the drive and the power on. Don't do the, you know, like the plugging the power, plugging the cable and the power on and plugging the drive. Don't do this way. Let's go all over again. Remember, put the drive in first and the power on. Press and hold copy button for three to five seconds. After that, press the copy button again. Where the copy started, we can see the numbers indicate light and the blinking fast. The numbers light is the stylus light. See how much they're doing the process. If you have a question, please leave the message on the below. Thanks.